Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Lock security feature on an Android device, also known as the FRP Lock for Factory Reset Protection. Now here with us today, we happen to have an Android tablet made by Lenovo, and this is called a Tab 10 because it has a, tab, it has a, a tablet with a 10 inch screen. And this device does indeed have the Google account lock enabled because as we can see here, as we're going through the setup steps, we get to the screen that tells us that the device was factory reset. And to continue, we have to sign in with a Google account that was previously on the device. So we've been contacted by tons of customers over the years asking us for assistance with this specific issue on this specific model, usually either because they themselves accidentally got locked out of their own device and couldn't remember or recover their login information after doing a factory reset, or because they purchased the device used from a dishonest seller who didn't tell them that the device was locked. And then obviously after the purchase, the buyer discovered the lock and they weren't going to have the login information to be able to get back in. And in those cases, the seller has usually long since disappeared since it's a very common scam that happens all the time these days in the buying and selling of used mobile devices. But we're making this video here to let any interested customers know that we do offer a service to be able to get the lock removed from this exact model without having to have the previous user's login information. It's something that we do directly to the device while it is plugged into a computer. And the great thing about this is that it's something that can be done for just about anyone anywhere in the world. So you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You would just need to have a decently powerful Windows PC along with a fast internet connection, and we can remotely connect right to your computer through the internet and perform the exact same procedure that we're doing right here right now. So as you could clearly see, the device was on the Google lock page and then I just powered it off and now I'm plugging it into our computer program that goes ahead and takes care of that lock for us. Once that process is done and the tablet reboots, we should then be able to see that we can indeed get all the way through the setup steps without seeing that Google lock. So just hold on here while the process finishes running. Okay, so it is now fully rebooted and we're back at the welcome screen. So we're gonna go ahead and click the arrow there to begin going through the initial setup steps. And then actually this process is gonna go faster if we don't connect to Wi-Fi. So I'm gonna go ahead and back up and turn that off. And then we're just gonna hit skip down here and then it'll ask us about adding a name to the device, which we don't need. We're just gonna skip through all of these steps. We don't need a screen lock, so that will be skipped also. And these are good indications that we see these options because we never could get to these previously while the device was locked. So that is a good indication that we are Yep, there we go. We're all the way through the setup steps. We have access to the home screen here with all of the apps and settings and features, and it's just like a brand new device that never had the lock on there. While we're here, I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the settings just to show you exactly what we're working with. So when we go under About Tablet, we do see here when we look at model number that we have the TBX103F. So that is the specific model number of the Tab 10 that we are working with here since Lenovo has a few different models. So if you have one of these exact Lenovo Tab 10 models with the Google Lock enabled and need help getting it removed, we would love to assist you with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description. And we'll also put a slide at the end of the video here that has all of our information there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have here on our channel, as we offer a lot of different services for thousands of models of mobile devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday. 
Hitting that subscribe button while you're there will enable you to be notified of all of the new videos that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like we're doing here with this one. Y para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes también nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks so much for watching, everyone, and have a great rest of your day.